Over 2 billion people today suffer from micronutrient malnutrition. These people may not look hungry or malnourished, but they are lacking the crucial vitamins and minerals needed to live fully active lives. Not enough iron makes us feel tired and less able to learn, work, and ensure healthy childbirths for both mother and child. Insufficient vitamin A weakens our immune systems and can lead to blindness. Pregnant mothers with severe iodine deficiency can give birth to children with permanent lower IQ. And insufficient folate is linked with a higher risk of birth defects like spina bifida. These consequences hinder development. The World Bank estimates that countries can lose between 2 and 3 percent GDP due to micronutrient malnutrition. Food fortification with essential micronutrients including iodine, iron, folate, and vitamins A and D is one of the most cost-effective ways to improve micronutrient intakes without requiring any change to the diet. Vitamins and minerals are added to staple foods and condiments at the normal processing stage, such as wheat and maize milling, vegetable oil refining, salt grinding, and condiments production. It has been practiced for nearly a century in the developed world, where it has helped to eradicate many diseases that are no longer public health threats today, like goiter, beriberi, and pellagra. Leading economists at the Copenhagen Consensus have repeatedly ranked food fortification among the top global priorities for development. Today, food fortification continues to be highly relevant, especially in the developing world, where people with low incomes do not have the necessary means to afford a varied diet full of fruits, vegetables, meat and dairy, which meets their daily nutritional needs. The majority of their diets consist of less expensive, stomach-filling foods, such as flour and rice. Over time, eating these foods alone can lead to micronutrient malnutrition and poor health. Food fortification helps to improve the nutritional content of these staple foods. Complementing regular diets for a basic and safe intake of certain essential vitamins and minerals each and every day. Since its inception in 2002, the Global Alliance for Improved Nutrition has been working with governments, civil society and food industries around the world to invest in food fortification in order to reach those living on less than two U.S. dollars a day through the existing food supply to live healthy, productive lives. Together with our partners, we are building a platform for future improved health. That way, we all gain.